it's such a fundamental question. Women make up more than half of the world's population and they shape family, community, business at every possible level and across every possible sector, whether they are recognised for their contributions or not. So if we are serious about co-creating or changing our journey for truly sustainable societies and economies, you cannot even have that conversation unless you put gender inclusion and true parity at the centre of that debate. And that operates at multiple levels. For us, it's a fundamental part of CISL's work. But when I look out at the world today, global south, global north, I am reminded that the seeds of conflict today or tomorrow lie so closely in the way we think about our natural resources, our human resources, and our approach to power. And women are part of shaping new paradigms, the kind of societies that we actually want, the kind of future we actually want. And I believe that they are a huge part of the solution because the world is looking for different approaches to leadership. And we already see examples around the world, south and north, where women in taking on senior political and corporate leadership have made massive impacts. And I believe that needs to be something that we mainstream and CSL stands right behind that as a central part of our mission and route to impact.